Alright, and we're back for the next boss. My setup hasn't changed one bit. You're going to find this out a lot, that I'm just using the same setup for almost all the bosses. There are bosses where I'll have different setups, but I don't think they come until later. Well, here we go. This is Atomos. Atomos was really annoying in the original version of, or in the original time he fought him in Final Fantasy V, and he's just as annoying here. Pretty standard opening turn, just get fast and fog two going, and try to weather the storm. This should miss. Yeah, Wormhole is basically a free turn for you. He's got a lot of powerful special attacks that can deal a ton of damage. So after you get uh, things set up, you're going to want to have both of your mages be on healing duty. I'm really a fan of the um, Fight 2 uh, remix from FF5 here. Atomos does have a lot of defense, so it can take a while to punch through his HP. He's got 13,000. Where's my heal helmet? Here it is. You'll find that the bosses towards the end of these dungeons have a lot of defense, so it can be very difficult to punch through. Oh, Comet hurts. Definitely want to follow that up with a Cure 3. Atomos is kind of slow, so you can usually get your turn off before he does, but not always. Now hopefully he doesn't Comet again. Okay, I can handle that. His physical attack, once you've stacked uh, Fog 2 a couple times, is pretty much a free turn. Uh, the only thing you really have to worry about is Comet, and I think one other attack he hasn't used yet. I can't remember what it is. I'll probably put it in like the video description or something if I can't remember what it is. Or he doesn't use it. With most of these fights, it's just about surviving the first couple turns. The big problem is what happens when, like, you screw up or he actually, you know, kills one of your guys because you got unlucky. Then bad things can happen. Hopefully this does a lot of damage. Not near as much as I'd like. I think Atomos has high magic defense. But it's better than anything we're doing right now, so let's just keep going. It's an extra 500 damage. There we go. I even managed to get him with one of the nukes. And for defeating Atomos, we get the Judgment Staff. The Judgment Staff, when used as an item in battle, will cast the nuke spell for free. Meaning you should be able to tear through pretty much any regular encounter down here now. I'm going to save the last two bosses of the Life Spring Grotto after I've gone through the next dungeon because the bottom two bosses here are way too hard for my current level. So I'll see you at the uh, Whisper Wind Cove next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy.